now let's see what we have left with just go to the data sheet we are left with the power selector circuit so we need a operational amplifier and some resistors just to go to the arcad capture cs go to place part and search for operational amplifier just type lm321 double click it place it here now this is not the schematic symbol that we want to use so we will edit this select the symbol right click go to edit part now the part that we are going to using in our project the first pin is input this is the input the pin number is one this is positive input the negative input will be pin number three the output pin is pin number four so simply i will delete this i will change this to pin number four i will also delete these pins delete this the pin number 5 will be our plus VCC. This will be the pin number 5. And this will be VCC. And pin number 2 will be our ground. So select this pin, change to pin number 2, and change the name to ground. You can also move this pin to here, delete this one, now right click, close it and update all, click yes. Now we will verify all the pins when we will assign the footprint to this component. Next we need some resistors, just type the resistor. This will be 10 kilo ohm. Copy and paste it. We need one more resistor to make a voltage divider here. The output of this comparator will go to N channel MOSFET. Just type MOSFET. Look for N channel MOSFET. We have to make the pin number visible for this MOSFET, right click, go to edit part, now click on this pin number visible. The first pin is our gate, you can verify from here, the first pin is gate, the second pin is our drain and third pin is our source. Now right click, close it, update current. Now we will make some connections. This terminal will be connected to V input. So we will place a net alias here as a V input. Output is connected to the gate of the P and channel MOSFET. Now the negative input will be connected to the 3.3 volt. Place a net alias here. Just type the USB VCC click OK we will place this on the source of this N channel MOSFET and on the output we will place 5 volt just copy the 5 volt port paste it here all 
also provide a power to the comparator control C control V now this circuit is a power selector when we are using a 12 volt DC then this circuit will switch off the USB VCC power but if 12 volt DC is disconnected then this circuit will switch on the power from USB VCC now we are almost done with our schematic except the power LED so we will place the power LED now just go to the place part type the resistor place your resistor here now select for LED we will use a 1 kilo ohm resistor and we will use the green LED as power LED now copy the ground symbol and paste it here similarly we will also copy the 5 volt now we are done with our schematic in the next step we will rearrange all the schematic and we will annotate it 